the Banff. That's the Bow River behind me. What we're going to do today is something a little different. A lot of people when they come to Banff on holidays uh, want to take great snapshots kind of the postcard image. What they do is they stand in downtown Banff and they pop a shot. I'm gonna show you a secret spot, a great spot to do your postcard shot. This is Cascade Gardens, right at the end of Banff Ave, and it is absolutely stunning here. So that's Banff Ave, straight down there where that Jeep turned. That's where all the shops are, and that's where the fudge factory is. Ho, 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 ho. So cross the Bull River Bridge is where you wanna go. You come in through that gate, Every so often, when I go out and shoot, I like to give myself a challenge. I didn't want to simply use a neutral density filter or a graduated neutral density filter to bring down the sky. I wanted to limit myself just to a polarizer and see what I could come up with. My concept was pretty simple. I wanted to do a quick run and gun style shoot. Get in, pop the shot, and get out of town because if you've ever been in the town side of Banff on a Saturday in summer you know the level of insanity Banff Ave can get plus we're getting close to golden hour and I had a great spot to do sunset that video will come soon so there's the steps of the administration building and if you just turn and look the other way that's the view you get. This is gonna be awesome. My camera is set up in the portrait position. Got a polarizer on. Might do this as an HDR, maybe focus stack. Look at that! Combine them together and get an awesome shot. Not too far HDR, but just a gentle HDR. Because the middle area of the composition where all those green trees are, it gets kind of dark and muddy. Have a look. So the area I'm talking about is right in here. During the exposure, it's exposing for the highlights, which is the sky and the water, but the middle area gets really, really dark. So we'll do a three shot. Three shot, there's three fingers. We'll do a three shot composure. One for the highlights, one for the low, and one for the mids. Combine them together. Yes, I should have waited for golden hour. Yes, I should have waited for better light. But sometimes when you're out and your plan is to hit more than one location, Mother Nature doesn't play nice. Sometimes she gives you a crappy sunset. Sometimes the light doesn't happen or sometimes there's no clouds and all you get is a blue sky sunset. But when you're faced with the majestic beauty of the Rocky Mountains, what are you doing? Pop the shot. You never know, you might get something tasty. Just look at that alpine glow.
Well, was I wrong? The best views of downtown Banff in the evening are right here, right along the Bow River. It's peaceful, it's calm. Grab a coffee, sit and listen to the reflecting pond, the birds. You're away from the tourists. There's a few here, but it's not as busy as what you think it is, especially not as busy as midday. <sighs> Spectacular. In the meantime, and in between time, I'll catch you next time. And as always, if you like what you see, hammer that like button, destroy that subscribe button, ring that bell. I greatly appreciate it.